Hey guys, Amy here. I just want to let you know that um, in this particular video, we did not show any of the processing, but you may see some blood and guts because uh, we did dispatch a lot of our uh, flocks. <sighs> Sorry, I'm getting eight of my mosquitoes already. I hate these things. But you may see some blood and guts um, and uh, some of the processing stuff, but none of the killing. And also, too, in this video, just to kind of, you know, keep it lively and, and within uh, the parameters of, you know, YouTube. <laughs> um, in the beginning here, we uh, had to go visit um, Uncle Wayne one day to help him out with a pool. And I took some video of his staghorn plant. It's huge. And then um, my parents went up to Ohio and they actually filmed the farm that I grew up. Uh, they did a drive-by and uh, uh, that farm is just so, so many memories for me. <laughs> so that's also in here, but also too, we got, um, like I said, we dispatched uh, Big Boy and that was a whopper. See, I'm telling you these mosquitoes are just getting to me. So, all I want to say is um, enjoy the video and you'll get to see at the end how much we processed, how we did it, and what we put into our freezers for this uh, season. All right, here we go. All right, we are at Uncle Wayne's house and he has a five foot staghorn. I mean, it's literally on a chain. This thing is just huge. Really cool looking. So tiny compared to Big Boy. Gobble, but I know. Gobble. He tried. <laughs> and then 
Where's your puppy? Maybe next time, huh? Sorry. Yes, sorry. Yes. All right, guys. So I am out here in the old duck pen. And Donald told me that he saw a papaya tree out here. Now, I don't like being out here, but I did see our poke tree. This is a uh, poke. It's gorgeous looking. It is poisonous. It's something you gotta be careful with, but right behind the poke tree is this tall papaya and it's got a bunch of blooms on it and it's pretty thick too so I'm gonna see if I can weasel my way around this mess go take a look at it I am getting ate up by mosquitoes like crazy out here but there's the papaya. Nice. It is a really good looking papaya trunk and everything. And I got beauty berries all over. I think I need to harvest some beauty berries so I can make some jelly this season. This is as far as I want to adventure right now. I am getting ate up, so I am gonna go back, but there's that poke tree. And it looks like we've got deer out here. I'm seeing hiding places where there's, where they've been uh, resting, sleeping, whatever you wanna call it, but yep, there's a nice papaya. All right, we butchered big boy. And I have the camera lens zoomed all the way out. And I am literally, I can touch the table from where I'm standing. That's how big this thing is. He is monster, he is a monster. Yeah. Oh, you put it on the fan. Oh, sorry. Ooh. Holy cow, that's a big heart. You want to save it or you want to cook it up? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay, we got the two ringnet pheasants and they weigh just over three pounds. That'll make a nice meal for me and Donald one night. All right, we got one of the ducks. And looks like two and a half pounds. All right, duck number two is two pounds exactly. Duck number three, almost three pounds. Duck number four, two and a half pounds. Duck number five, two and a, almost two and a half pounds. All right, chicken number one wants to be fancy here. Got the legs sticking up. But that one is just over three pounds. 
All right, this is chicken number two. Just a little bit over three and a half pounds. Okay, turkey number one is almost six and a half pounds. All right, turkey number two, seven pounds. All right, turkey number three, just a hair over seven pounds. All right, and the last turkey, almost seven pounds. All right, this is big boy. And he is at 32 pounds. All right, this is the neck of the big boy. It literally weighs one pound. We're gonna use that for stock. Okay, these are just the legs and the wings off a of big boy. Eight and a half pounds. All right, we got the grinder out. It's a little noisy. But we're grinding up all the meat that we decided to uh, not keep. And we'll let you know how many pounds of uh, ground beef we got with everything. We are done. So, this is 10, 10, 10, two, and then this is a half a, just a half a pound. Donald seasoned it, so we're use it for like, um, for like uh, sausage and biscuits or country fried steak gravy. And then I did four two pounders. So all together, ground up, we had 40.5 pounds all together. We have one turkey on the barbecue right now because we're hungry. It's a lot of work. And then we saved one for Christmas. But all in all, yeah, we got a lot of wings and drumsticks that we saved uh, for, you know, quick, easy meals. But, you know, this is the fruit the rewards of our fruit and labors and that's why we do this put meat on our put meat in our freezer and it's grown by us so don't need to worry about anything all right you guys have a good one we'll see you on the next one